Hello, I'm Avril Hitman. I'm the founder, artistic and executive director of Magpie Dance. I founded Magpie 1985 as a weekly recreational class for a group of adults with learning disabilities for just 45 minutes weekly. Fast forward to current day and now Magpie delivers over 350 sessions annually for over 300 people in a range of settings. I'm Natasha Mansfield Osborne, the Youth Group Director. We have five youth groups at Magpie now. We have a junior session which is for dancers aged 8 to 15 and we have four youth groups for uh, senior members who are aged 16 to 25. Three of our youth group sessions are based on creative dance. So we look at all the dancers making their own choices and being part of the process of what we're creating. The other two sessions are um, contemporary technique sessions where we look at developing people's skills. A key aspect of the way that we work is we have live musicians in every session, which is really fantastic because the musicians are able to respond to the dancers' movement and play specifically for them as well as inspire them through their creativity. Uh, the dancers work in a really wonderfully supportive way with each other. A lot of the dancers work on their skills of supporting each other as well as their own dance skills, which is a really wonderful way of working. So the group really bonds and works together as a team. I've been at Magpie for about two years. I enjoy Magpie because uh, in the future I want to work with special needs children. The, uh, the skills I have improved is um, making friends, uh, confident in speaking to people. Um, I, also, I also do peer mentoring, which is basically helping other students. Because of peer mentoring, um, I've done three exams in peer mentoring and I've passed with 20 and plus so I am happy <laughs> yeah. so this program began four years ago um, and we are focusing on the session in improving people's communication skills, cooperation, confidence and dance skills. And within the dance skills we look at both the physical development and creativity. Uh, the impact of uh, Magpie on the service has been tremendous. We know that most of our patients are autistic and they find it difficult interacting with other people. But as a result of Magpie, we have seen increased interaction with the staff and with one another. So Magpie's performance programme enables dancers with learning disabilities to perform on main stages and take leadership roles. We have performed at some of the leading dance venues across London, for example Sadler's Wells, The Place, Trinity Laban. This enables Magpie's work to be seen by many more people and bring our work to audiences who may not have ever seen inclusive dance and people with learning disabilities performing alone on stage.
ever since I was in training, I have had a, a, a knowledge of Magpie and the work that they do. So I've known about Magpie for a long time, and I knew the the standard and the quality of the stuff that they produce. Um, and that says, some, that says something about the quality of the company. It says something about the relationship with the company. They have this atmosphere in there of, um, we want to work with each other, we know how to work with each other, we have the same drive, we have the same uh, things that we want to, to achieve. And clearly they're doing that. 30 years, that's phenomenal. We have a new programme called High Flyers which began two years ago. It is for talented dancers with learning disabilities who aspire to have a career in dance. Dancers have to audition for this programme because it takes the training to a new level in the professional sphere. High Flyers provides an environment for dancers with learning disabilities to really explore their potential as dancers, to learn how to meet uh, the demands of professional performance, to respond intelligently to a creative, choreographic process. Having worked with the dancers for a year, um, I, you know, I have to say they have developed so much, all of them, and really exceeded expectations my expectations, their expectations. So it really goes to show that uh, creating opportunity like this is of massive value to dancers with learning disabilities and to the dance sector as well, as I think these guys have got a lot to offer in terms of the kind of electric passion that they bring to uh, a performance process. When I first started I was very dramatic, um, but now I'm, now I'm getting better as I was before. It feels like that I'm, it feels like that I'm being professional and it also feels like that I'm, it feels like, wow. I was just going to say, just believe in yourself. It's the best way to get involved in the dance. So you keep carrying on. Just focus on, focus on yourself and, rem and remember who you are and just come to dance, just believe in yourself. Magpie's training programme involves delivering training for arts and dance professionals, teachers in schools, mainstream and special schools, and higher education professionals, so universities. These are people who want to come to Magpie to understand and explore more about how inclusive practice works so that they can feel more confident in the workplace. Magpie has been instrumental in changing attitudes to people with disability, crucially important. They've worked with the police force, with the National Health Service, but very widely in the dance sector. So many dance artists wouldn't be working in this area if it wasn't for Magpie. I think today I'm really keen on sharing practice and talking and getting conversations up that you don't have. So I think it's really good to be with a group of like-minded people and sharing practice because freelance life can be quite lonely. So I think it's really nice to share in that way. And so it's really nice that there's a day that you can come to, you can meet lots of different people from different backgrounds, um, you can learn about their tips and their advice and also the wealth of experience that say Magpie can have um, is invaluable experience.
thought the show was absolutely amazing, really entertaining, and I couldn't believe what I was seeing, really. I was, I was amazed by it. It's really, really good. Really, really, really good. It's absolutely fantastic. It's an extraordinary opportunity and to see that these children here have an amazing time doing what they like. And especially coming from a different country that has little or no opportunity, I think is amazing. So well done. What a marvellous thing to see. Absolutely brilliant. It was wonderful and inspiring. Absolutely excellent as always. Can't give enough praise to the staff, obviously, who commit so much time and uh, encouragement to the youngsters. I think it's absolutely marvellous. The way they performed it with such joy and happiness, uh, it was wonderful to watch. I feel very, um, um, very lucky to have watched that this afternoon. OK, congratulations to everyone at Magpie. It's um, been an amazing evening, fantastic dance. The quality of the performance is just incredible. And I'm just really honoured to have seen Magpie's work over the year. I was at the first performance at the Churchill Theatre and being here tonight is really special. So well done to everyone who was involved and particularly well done to all the performers. You're all incredible. For the last 30 years, Magpie has delivered quality, inclusive dance practice some of the most vulnerable people in society to help them develop their skills and self-confidence. We are committed as an organisation to continuing that quality practice for the next 30 years and beyond.